People telling you what type of video to post, what to do. I'm doing my part. Guarantee you're gonna be walking to the house like, damn, I don't know why I'm singing this song though. <laughs> I do it all. This is my channel. I do things my way. Let's have some fun. Let's, let's get it. What's poppin'? <laughs> I know y'all like, why this nigga got flies up here? You know, flies are dope. Flies got a, um, he got a couple of good songs. Actually, the album is pretty good. A couple of good songs. But, um, there's one song in particular that, uh, that it can motivate you like out of crazy situations, like for real. Like for real, and I was like, "Damn!" But when he first dropped, when I first seen this one, I was like, "Who the fuck is this dude?" I don't like it, right? And then um, song came on again, and I used to always switch the channel when it came on. Switch the channel. I want to see that shit, right? And then one time I couldn't find a remote, <laughs> and that shit played. I'm like, ah, oh, I, I still fuck with T Pain because T Pain is dope. I was like, all right, I'll listen to it. So I'm listening to it with disgust at first. You know, you know, you got that little mean face when you want when you're doing something you don't want to do. So I'm sitting there like, next thing you know, I'm like, and then it's like, wait, this nigga said some dope shit. How would I? He may not have written this shit. I don't give a fuck, but this nigga said some dope shit. And then it became one of my favorites, man. Oh, man. So I was like, if I ever do applies, if I ever, whenever do applies reaction, this was going to be the first one. Without a doubt. <laughs> this shit is dope. Files is nice at this time. I mean, I, I hate that he fell off, but he still do a uh, other shit, but Files is dope. Goon affiliated? <laughs> yeah. Fly, shorty. T Pain. His shit is dope. T Pain is dope as hell. Oh, man. Y'all. T Pain. All right. <laughs> I like doing videos like this because like I said, it gives me time to calm down because I've been doing other videos and I never really heard, never heard the song. And it takes me a long ass time. So doing these 20 minute videos, 15, 20 minute videos, maybe 10. Is it a journey for me, man? I like this shit. I like, it. and some of them might be longer because they might spark a story. Other than that, we here for it, man. Boss, keep paying shorty. You watch me, I'm watching you. You hear? I gotta put this down for you. Let's get it. Hey, what's happening, now, man? This is Lil' Woe Plies, man. Sorry. Hey, Payne, I want you to tell him about your show, yeah, though, man. Yeah. And I'm gonna tell him about mine, though. Even though I'm not your man, you're not my girl, I'm gonna call you my show. I can't stand it till you treat it bad I beat his ass for my shorty And we ain't did nothing that we ain't supposed to do Cause you my Baby girl you know I be home Keep me on the ringtone Say it to me girl Soon as I seen the shit Told her I'd pay for it The mom the baddest thing around And she already know it I pointed at the dunk and told her This pose to be yours Showed her cover stice and told her I'd let her blow it The hottest nigga in the city, baby, you can't ignore it I showed her I was a real nigga and she went for it First time I caught her shit, she didn't know how to throw a bike Now she an animal, I got a sex game right I told her Nigga Tell me, that, tell me oh, I know this probably one of y'all Got some of y'all first time hearing that Bruh Bruh That nigga applies was tricking I couldn't get with the chicken because I'm not gonna just give somebody some money. No, I don't have to pay sh for shit. That's not my style. Fuck, I look like walking to you, getting you stacked. Something I work hard for. Fuck, I look like. Them niggas tricking like that. That's why the generation the way it is now. Cause now these motherfuckers feel entitled. Like, super fucking entitled. Makes it sad for my son. Like, oh, man. <laughs> but, 
Man, fuck, I ain't gonna say that, because I don't even need to say that. We already know. The motherfucker's entitled. We ain't doing that. We 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 ain't remember that I remember that song. It's it was a dope song. And I and I sung along with it. It ain't tricking if you got a trick tricking it. Yeah, you know, I was doing the dance too, right? Trick it if you got but nigga, I ain't finna trick. Fuck it look like trick, bruh. Let them go out there and get it. If you ain't got if you ain't got somebody that can go out there and get it with you, you got a fucking child. That's what you got. You ain't got no damn woman or no man. You got a fucking <laughs> You got a baby that you're raising. <laughs> this the fuck you got. Oh man, this generation is so fucking cooked. Ugh. Terrible. I've seen I seen so many stupid ass lists to take me out. I seen some people gotta pay a fee to take. I'm like, niggas really paying that? Motherfucker said pay her 500 to take her out? Nigga. And y'all paying that? You know what they say, nigga, the rents do. <laughs> Niggas is, oh, bad. Say it to me, soon as I seen the shit, told her I'd pay for it. The mom the baddest thing around, and she already know it. I pointed at the dunk and told her this supposed to be yours. Showed her a couple stacks and told her I'd let her blow it. The hottest nigga in the city, baby, you can't ignore it. I showed her I was a real nigga, and she went for it. First time I caught her shit, she didn't know how to throw it back. Now she an animal, I got a sex game right. I taught her how to talk to me while she take pipe. And open up and show her what a real nigga like. I told her you to do this, I don't fuck on the first night. Cause after I beat you, baby, I'm liable to fuck up your whole life. I got a train, now, now she suck me with ice. I call her my little busted, baby, cause she keep it tight. Whenever I tell her to bust, they ain't got to tell her twice. Whatever I want to get off, she know how to get me right. You know I'm not your man, you're not my girl, I'ma call you my Charlie. So I can't stand to see you treated bad, I'll be this ass for my Charlie. This is the time where T Pain was killing every fucking thing, and T Pain can actually can sing, you know, Nappy Boy, right? Tiffany, uh, was he Tiffany? Three Rings was nice. Um, what was the name of that CD? I think it was the Tiffany. The CD when he's standing and it's like the the shit in the background, but you can see like in the desert. I forgot the name of that damn CD. That scene was dope, though. You know, you about the other two. When I first heard T-Pang, I heard the I'm, I'm Sprung. And I'm like... I'm Sprung. Right? You know, like, just, I was like, damn, what the fuck? Strip? And then I heard I'm in love. Same shit. No, I heard I'm Sprung first. I'm in love with a stripper. That was different. And then I heard... um. Chief Payne got a bunch of hits now that I think about it. God damn, there's so much stuff going in my head. I can't even. Talking about he couldn't sing because he used auto tune. You said he'd like the way it sounds. <sighs> Fuck it. I got to figure out the name. What was that CD? I don't know why I keep thinking of Epiphany. It might be Epiphany because that's the only name I can think of right now. But y'all, if y'all know T-Pain, go check the nigga out. Ooh, I can't believe it. Bruh. Of course you know who T-Pain is. That's why you're here. Or right, this is, you finna get, you finna get real acquainted with this nigga right now. But this is when he was killing shit. And Plies, yeah. Shit for Step of Thunder. I ain't gotta break nothing down. You said some dope ass shit. It's tricking shit, but it's some dope ass shit. Get me right. You know I'm not your man, you're not my girl. I'ma call you my Charlie. So I can't stand it till you treat it bad. I be this ass for my Charlie. And we ain't getting nothing that we ain't supposed to do. Cause you my Baby girl, you know I be home. Keep me on the ringtone. Charlie. Say it to me, girl.
beat, babe. Lick all that. That always makes me laugh because I love I love the show because all the dope boys wanted to go to Rick Ross, nigga. <laughs> I got your bitch. <laughs> I did a dope. I know you show love in the video, but that's hilarious to me. Always been funny. I love to show off because all the dope boys want her. Nobody want to be bae. Look all that ass on her. Look how that pussy sit up in them songs. You gotta want her. Love when she act like she bow legged and bend the corner. She proud to be fucking me because I'm stunting on her. It feel good to be fucking a real nigga on her. Ain't called in two days. Gotta let her mind wander. But when she miss me, she called and tell me to jump on her. That's why I'm mind breaking off because she ain't with the drama. If you didn't rip the before, you know I didn't cuff the mama. You know she gotta be something because I didn't beat a Honda. Bay snatching now and now. I'm telling you. This nigga ain't speaking the real shit, bro. I don't know what is. Like, if you don't feel like, like how you talking to a girl, you ain't got to trick out on like this nigga talking about it because them niggas just know pretending. I mean, you know, people see that shit, get influenced by that shit. Oh, to get the women, you gotta have money. No, you don't. I mean, it's cool. You can't be like totally broke, but you ain't gotta have all that money. I done went to the mall back in the days with uh with some PJs on, some fucking Simpson hot shoes, and came with a pocket full of numbers. That's just how it goes. That's how much confidence I have. It's not cocky. I'm just confident. It's just what it is. You know, I, I walk like I carry myself. I don't give a fuck what they was thinking. Think I'm broke? Oh well, I don't care. I'm one of those people that can have a whole bunch of money and still live like I'm fucking broke because I don't want attention drawn to my fucking self. That's just what it is. Like, I don't need attention. If there was a way to, you know, like okay, like this, like this right here. I don't think Pop wrote this shit, right? We're gonna always go check, but I don't think he wrote this shit. So the person who wrote it, right? Think how much money they getting paid and never been seen living in life. Or the people that be uh, writing those songs for them, for them singers, because they can't sing, but they got they write good songs. How much are they getting paid? The person that's singing the song, yes, you, you see them, but the songwriters, nigga, it's always it's always better to be behind the scenes making money so nobody know you. Then I understand why Sia don't like her face being shown. Can't have a normal life. I think I, I think I, uh, somebody like Ann would have did some shit like that. He can have a normal life, but he, you know, back in the day, you want you, you want to rap. You want to be you. He's white. He can't even do that. She's white. He wanted to be recognized for his skills. But I'm just saying, just think about that shit. Like I didn't even know fucking Scott Scorch was fucking white. That was crazy when I found. Out. I was like, God damn, nigga, like what? Shit blew my damn mind. But it's just shit like that. But he said some real shit, and it's that's why I paused it right here. I'm gonna rewind a little bit. But he said some real shit right here. Like, I'm going to say it with it because that shit was dope. That shit was dope. Gotta let her mind wander But when she miss me, she called and tell me to jump on her That's why I'm mind breaking off Cause she ain't with the drama If you didn't rip the before, you know I didn't cuff the mama You know she gotta be something Cause I didn't beat a Honda Baby snatching now and now I'm telling you, I promise I exposed her to the real and now she hate lame Remember she used to run from me, now she like pain She called me sometimes just to ask me is it her thing But since I ran up and shouted, she ain't been the same picture with the girl was in a pool by herself everybody just standing around that's today's party back in the day everybody used to dance you know we have to be, be put on social media everybody used to go out and have fun i remember when my prom happened and we went to the club everybody was on the floor everybody was on the floor that was a fun ass night
I was all up at the club and then the homeboy wanted to go and do the crib work and the blow all in the middle. So I was like, let's go do that shit. I was like, all right, come on, let's go do it. He didn't know I know how to do both of them, so we was both doing that shit in the middle of the flow. You know, we just did all that shit. This shit was fun. Everybody was there to have a good time, but then everybody else was joining in. We was all doing it in the big ass crowd and doing that shit. Everybody getting along. Those are the good old days, man. You know, you take your girl, go to the wall, she give you a little wall dance, nigga. You gotta go. The wall dances, bruh. Uh, I'm getting. I'm telling you, man, I got stories for days. I had a crazy ass childhood. Yeah, I see. Yeah, I see the shit I've been telling on the other videos. But that shit be sparking. I'm telling you, bruh. My childhood was fucking crazy. <laughs> Everybody always asks, what would you change? Where would you go back and change? If you go back in time, I tell them nothing. Am I exactly where I want to be? I'm not really. But everything that I did got me up to this point, and I won't change nothing. Because one little slight thing I changed, I can probably never meet my son's mom and never have my son. You know what I mean? I, I don't wanna, like, I couldn't picture my life without my son. I wouldn't change nothing. I just learn from my mistakes. I learn from other people's mistakes, and I just move forward. I may look back, but I'm not thinking about going back. I'm just looking back to see how far I came. That's it. Just like with the damn YouTube shit. There was a time when I only had one subscriber for like a month. No, actually, it wasn't a month. It was four subscribers for like a month because my homeboys was my first subscriber four subscribers for a month like that's crazy and i kept posting up shit because this is what i want to do it made me enjoy this shit so i just kept doing kept doing it and like i'm doing it now because i enjoy it i do what i want to do that's why i'm still doing it I kept doing it kept doing it even be able to like you should do this you should do that no nah, don't tell me how to run my channel go do it on your channel just how i want to do my shit this is what making me happy i'm not doing it to make you happy I'm glad that you're enjoying yourself while you're here, but I'm doing this shit to make me happy. That's why I started my channel. There's some shit I could have did to, to focus on and it'll boost it up, but for what, man? I wasn't happy doing it. <laughs> Every goal that I set myself, I gave myself. Every, I mean, set myself, gave myself, I completed. I'm fine. And a partner, YouTube partner, I don't know, I'm just having a good ass on. I just need to be more consistent. But, that's for another day, but these damn, uh, these songs like this, bruh. Another day. Holla.